dear students today we discuss the topic of method study so the method study consists of uh, these basic steps first one is select we have to select the job that we studied second record we have to record all types of words and the process for analyzing the job examine critically examine the recorded facts to be record and we have to examine it and develop develop and improve method evaluate evaluate different alternatives for cost effectiveness and next is install install the new method that we have developed and evaluate it and last one is maintain the new method so these are the basic method study procedure so we discuss one by one what are these procedure how to perform the method study so the number one is the select so the basic parameter for selecting any job that should be studied uh, consists or mainly depends on the economic aspect technical aspect and the human aspect because what we are selecting we have to select according to these three aspects because uh, the overall uh, effect of the method study is to increase the productivity and to provide comfort for human worker so we have to consider economic as well as human and that uh, apart from these two aspects the technological aspect is also important because uh, we have to deal with the technology while the process is going on. Uh, basically, for industries or for industrial application, the cost is the main criteria for selection of the job, process, and department for method analysis. So, when once we selected the job that this job uh, uh, must be studied, then we have to uh, move further for the second step, and that is record. So in record we have to uh, record all relevant information relating to the existing method in detail and in the form of chart to obtain more clear picture about the same. So there are many recording techniques uh, uh, including two-handed process chart, outline process chart, flow process chart, schema chart. So there are uh, many more uh, recording techniques we have to follow any one of them to record but the uh, we have to use some advanced techniques so that can we we can easily analyze the job so the recording techniques are more diversified there are micro motion and uh, micro motion are also there third one is the examine we have to examine the recorded facts what we have recorded so we have to critically examine those facts recorded facts so during examination we have to check or we have to uh, examine the facts critically in terms of purpose place sequence and person and and try to seek some alternatives we have to simplify the some complex operations and some unwanted operations that are not needed we have to eliminate them so this is the most important steps because after recording after recording the process the examination is the most important steps because in, in this step, we find out what to do and what will be done. And according to our examination on the recorded facts, we have to develop the most practical, uh, economic, economical and effective method so that uh, it can serve our purpose. So the fourth step is our develop the model or some uh, solution or a method for the problem that we selected. Now the fifth step is evaluate different alternatives to developing a new improved method comparing the cost effectiveness of the selected new method with the current method. So basically we have to evaluate the different alternatives of the uh, method that we are going to propose and we have to compare the cost effectiveness of the various other existing methods so in terms we have to evaluate the uh, 
uh, effectiveness of our uh, uh, effectiveness of our proposed method now the sixth one is the install so we have select record examine develop and evaluate now the other term that what we have evaluated what we have developed we have to install it so install the new method as a standard practice and train the person involved in applying it so we have to train our the worker labor what what and the other operator who are working on that process to train with the so they are well equipped with the new method and we we have to train them and we have to take some sessions we have to uh, and understand that the workers are workers are not uh, so much uh, uh, so much happy to accept the change so you, you have to convince them properly that the change is for their betterment you have to convince them you have to train them if they cannot uh, work properly if they do not uh, understand the technological advancement or technical know how then uh, they will uh, remain out of uh, that process and they 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 will they will not accepting easily so you have, you have to uh, convince the worker properly for convincing the best method is to train them if they are well equipped with that method they, they will happily do it so we have to install the method and we have to train the worker and last one is the maintain so the maintain the new method and introduce a control procedure to prevent it drifting back to the previous method of the work so we have to maintain that the new procedure may uh, go and all all other stakeholders may happily accept it and it it will go further so this is uh, some basic concepts or some basic steps in the method study from starting from select record examine develop evaluate install and maintain these are some basic uh, in some other books it, it they may vary some some uh, after develop you have to define it evaluate examine install so it may be there so the, these are the fundamentals thank you thank you for attention thank you for watching this thank you very much